everybody. I hope this finds you well. I had an interesting experience today after digging out from the snowstorm. Kind of a funny one. Old man. Which your mind does to a person when you get older. I'm studying myself on this one. Some of the stupid things people do, including myself. This morning, I found myself getting ready to do a hmm, ponage video on someone. Uh, it dawned on me. How do you pwn an empty account, an empty face? It's like trying to make fun of a non thing. Hmm. You can make a troll joke. Troll jokes. They're kind of funny sometimes. No. I'm just putting this out there to you know. I do stupid things too sometimes, you know. I can say stupid things. And I too guilty of going around and trolling things, you might say. We all troll the internet in a way. Uh, except some of us are just a little more outspoken than others. And I do try to be kind, but you run upon one of these faceless entities, sock accounts, and things like that, and they pop out at you with some venom, call you names and things. It's tiresome after a while, putting up with that. I lose my patience with them, and I, I ask y'all to forgive me for that. been patient with you and your type for a very long time. It's on nerves after a while. But you try to let it go. You know, the old me, the on saved me before. That man would have been looking you up. He'd been looking you up with some hatred of his own in mind. So I must question myself, my own motives, what in my mind's driving me this way. Who knows? Ravings of an old man. I'm going to give this an arrest, chalk this up to my own personal stupidity. Not that I was wrong in the arguments, but I was wrong in how I handled it. I must do better next time. Now hopefully, my little friendly little troll, whom I'd gotten short with, Consider the same thing, being such a pig-headed hater. Just because life didn't treat you right, no reason for you to treat everybody else the same way. So, but I know you can't help yourself. Some people are born that way. You know, we all have this time to come upon a crossroads in our lives. We have to make a choice which way do we want to go.
choose the path less, path less traveled. Maybe a harder road, but it has much more reward. The other way looks nice and shiny. And so does Las Vegas, and the house always wins. So um, take that thought. I just take it as another rambling from an old man. I had to make a video. I haven't for a while. Been awful busy. Then the storm hit. We got through it. And I'll get through tonight. You all stay at peace. I know things are hard now. I know it looks like we wake up to a twilight zone every morning. You look at the things that are going on. Remember this. Our Lord rose from the ground, rose from his grave. And he lives. I believe this with all my heart. And a man that trusts only in his own wisdom is a fool. When I start thinking I'm all that, I'm a fool. So I have to lean on God's wisdom. And you don't have to like that. Many of you won't understand it. But it's what it is. And you ain't going to change it. And so, have a good weekend, everybody. Peace, love, and understanding be with you all.